right, everybody. Welcome to another week of what is in my kids' lunchbox. Um, every day I'll show you what I make them and then how much of it they eat. So today is only Nate going to school. Lucy tested positive for flu on Friday. And although she's a lot better, she's still not 100%. So she's staying home. Um, but Nate is ready to go. He's been fine. He is almost 10 and he's in fourth grade. He has autism, but he has come so far with what he will eat. It used to be a real struggle, but he's done really good lately. So let me show you guys what he has today. I decided to do a breakfasty lunch. He likes these. So he has got some French toast sticks. I just cut into bite-sized pieces. Um, they're warm right now, but they won't be warm at lunch. He doesn't normally mind that. So he's got some of those. He's got some strawberries. He's got an apple cinnamon cereal bar. And he's got some goldfish. He always takes a milk. It's just his what he likes to drink with his meals. So he's got a milk to go with that. And then for snack today, he's got a Kool-Aid jammer, strawberry kiwi, and some Doritos. He's in here hanging out with me. So when he gets home, I'll show you guys how he did. All right. Nate is home. Let's see how he did. He ate everything and he drank his milk. So he had a great day at school. We'll see you guys back tomorrow for Tuesday. All right, everybody, we're here at Tuesday. Unfortunately, Lucy is still not feeling well, so she's gonna be staying home again today. Um, but let me show you what Nate has. Um, I did him a quesadilla again. So we've just been doing cheese. And then yesterday I added, not yesterday, last week, I, I added turkey to it, um, which he's had at home before, but never at school. And then today we're adding something different to the cheese quesadilla, which he's had before, but not recently. And I had a little bit of shredded chicken left over from dinner. So I added some shredded chicken in with the cheese. So we'll see how that goes. This is actually a really big quesadilla. So he may not even eat all of this, but we'll see. So we've got a chicken and cheese quesadilla some color color goldfish and some strawberries of course he's got his milk to go with it and then for snack today he's got some wavy potato chips and a kool-aid jammer tropical punch so that is what little nate big nate has <laughs> he's getting so big you guys he's almost 10 um that's what nate has today we'll see you guys back when he gets home and we'll see how he did all right everybody nate just got home he's still got a about half of his milk left. Let's see how he ate. Okay, he did eat some of it because, like I said, that was a bunch of quesadilla. Um, maybe a third to half of it he ate. Not too bad. I think he likes it just cheese better. But anyway, not too bad. We'll see you guys back tomorrow. Hopefully, Lucy will be feeling better. All right, everybody. Welcome to Wednesday. Yay for two lunches. Lucy is going back to school today, so we're very excited for her. Let me show you what they have today. So Nate has some chicken nuggets. I just cook these in the air fryer and then cut them into little pieces. Um, again, they will not be hot at lunch, but he doesn't normally mind that. He's got a strawberry cereal bar, some extra toasty Cheez-Its, and some lemon Oreo thins. He's got his milk to drink, and then he has Doritos and a Kool-Aid jammer for snack. For Lucy, I try to keep things pretty light for her. She's got a chewy chocolate chip bar just because she's, you know, still got a cough. She still has the best appetite. Anyway, chewy chocolate chip bar, string cheese, some cucumber and carrots, some watermelon, goldfish, and some fruit snacks. She's got a water for her desk, and then she also has a Kool-Aid jammer tropical punch and some wavy potato chips. So that's what they have today, and we'll see you guys when they get home, and we'll see how they did. All right, you guys, the kids both got home from school. Nate ate all of his lunch. Lucy says she's still a little bit nauseated throughout the day, but she did pretty good. She had her chewy bar, her veggies, a little bit of the watermelon, fruit snacks. This is still really cold, so I'm going to stick it back in the fridge. We will see you guys back here for Thursday coming up next. Okay, everybody, welcome to Thursday. Let me show you what the kids have today. So let's start over here with Nate. Um, we had some frozen pizza last night. So I just heated that up in the air fryer, cut it into bite-sized pieces. This will not be hot at lunch. He doesn't mind uh, room temperature pizza. So he has that. 
He has some alphabet cookies from Trader Joe's. And then he has a bunch of strawberries, which he loves strawberries. He's got a milk to go with that. And then for snack today, he's got another Kool-Aid Jammer Tropical, Tropical Punch, extra toasty Cheez-Its. Lucy has another snacky lunch. Her appetite is still not 100%, but I tried to put stuff in here that might, you know, make her happy. She's got some pepperoni. She's got some cut up cucumber, some veggie straws, just a few pieces of strawberries, grapes, and a fudge brownie that I made this week. She's got a water for her desk. And then she also has some barbecue potato chips and um, that's her snack. And then she'll drink the Kool-Aid jammer with her lunch. So that is what they have today. We will see you guys when they get home and we'll tell you how they did. All right, you guys, the kids are home. Mark just got up from his nap and he is very cranky. So let's see. Nate ate everything. And Lucy did really good too. She just got a few things left. So I will take it one more day, y'all. We're almost at Friday. We'll see you there. All right, everybody, we've made it to Friday. Let me show you what the kids have. So they really like to take pasta on Friday, so we always pull out the thermoses on Friday. I always prime these with boiling water, so what I do is I just fill them up with boiling hot water, put the lids on them, and then let them sit while I'm making everything else, usually about, I don't know, as long as I have, 15 minutes or so. Dump out the boiling water, put in the hot food I warmed up, and it will stay warmer a lot longer. So Nate has some mac and cheese in here left over from last night. He's got a side of strawberries and then he's got his thermos of milk to drink with that. For snack today, he's got one of these grape squeeze juices and some Doritos. Lucy has some buttered spaghetti noodles. And then for her side in this little super cute mini, this is called a yum, yum box snack size. Um, she used to, it's so funny, She used this used to be her whole lunch when she was in preschool. I would pack her at lunch in this. It's crazy how much um, she's grown since then. But she has a side of strawberries and blueberries, a couple grapes, and a, another piece of a fudge brownie. Of course, they have their forks and spoons. She has a Kool-Aid jammer to drink with that. She's got some barbecue chips for snack and a water for her desk. So that is what they have today. We'll see you guys back when they get home and we'll see how they did. All right, everybody. So I had to get Lucy early um, because she had a headache. So she had her lunch at home. She's feeling a lot, lot better. But she ate, ate all of her pasta and all of her sides. Nate just got home. He had all of his mac and cheese and all of his strawberries. So very good week. We have two weeks left. It's nuts. Two weeks. Actually, a little less than two weeks. So make sure you stick around for next week. I will link everything down below that we use, all of the bento boxes. And we'll see you guys next time. If you like the video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and leave us a comment and subscribe. Bye, guys. <laughs>